What's up YouTube? Mimi here coming at you from my channel Bunny Birdie Gator. You guys I had a really hard time finding eggs when I was out today and I know I'm about to be on quarantine for another probably 10 days. This family dollar said that they have eggs so I'm going to try to get some more eggs. I also wanted to give you guys an update. No reusable bags are allowed in the store. Their hours are until 8 p.m. And the first hour of each day will be dedicated to seniors and vulnerable customers. They're also practicing the CDC guidelines. I'm seeing this in most stores where they want us to practice social distancing. Hi. Okay, you guys, I just wanna give you a quick update on the essentials that we have here. We do have water. Hi, honey. I came in here to get some eggs, so let's go take a look. You guys, Family Dollar is a great resource for some of these items that you're having a really hard time finding. One dozen eggs is $1.75 here. There were seven when I called, and now there are five left. I think I'm gonna practice the limit of two, which most stores are doing. I'm just gonna get two and leave the other three for someone else. It looks like we also have plenty of milk, cold water, juice, sliced cheese, shredded cheese, it looks like they also have some soap here and they've marked down some of the soap. This is the family dollar equivalent to dial. We also have some equivalents to Dove and other brands, Caress. A lot of the soap is on clearance this week. We have the body wash, the Caress is on clearance, the ivory, we have other products here and it looks like we have diapers. You know what, you guys, let me get my cart really quick. We are gonna keep this very brief. This is just an essentials update video. I just wanna help you guys know what's here so that you are aware of even like some of your local stores. We have purified water. We have a family wellness version of Pedialyte, Suero. We have toddler juice. It looks like we're pretty wiped out of the wipes. However, we do have some and we do have some diapers. I'm really, really happy to see that my store still has lots of diapers and lots of wipes. I want to take you guys down some of the canned good aisles. We'll see if we have rice. We'll see if we have beans. And I shouldn't be passing this up so quickly. Sorry, you guys. We have lunch meat everywhere I've been today, which is the same day I filmed at Dollar Tree and Walmart. Um, everywhere that I've been, I'm just mostly seeing salami and sort of the cheaper end lunch meat. But we do have some pizzas here, plenty of pizzas, and even some of the $1 pizzas. And a lot of the $1 food that we also see at places like Dollar Tree, Dollar Tree and Dollar General. We still have lots of frozen goods here. French fries, ice cream. Now I was in Walmart and they were totally wiped out of their ramen, but I'm really happy to see that they have ramen here. The big flats of ramen were totally gone in Walmart. So I think I'm gonna get this again. That way my kids can have ramen. They like to have ramen every couple of days. We still have lots of canned soup. Mostly the cream of mushroom is left. The chunky, the progressos. Over here, I think it's the hot dog buns. Yeah, the hot dog buns and the loaves of bread are totally gone. However, we do have some tortillas. And I think these are, I want to say they're a dollar because they sell these at Dollar Tree. Yes, this is 
for these Del Barrio tortillas. We have bottled water here. We have plenty of sweets. Even during this time, it seems like there is not a shortage of sweets whatsoever. It seems like there's a little bit of a shortage on boxed cakes, but my store still has flour and confectioner sugar, which there was a shortage of at Walmart. But yeah, we have a little bit of box cakes here. Plenty of dollar spices. And it looks like we're running a little bit low on the spaghetti. We have dollar options, macaroni, rotini, fettuccine, and spaghetti. And we still have some sauces. And I'm really happy to say that Family Dollar has rice. This is the two pound bag for $1.90. And we also have instant rice. And some of the sides are here. And it looks like we have tuna fish here and mackerel and pink salmon. We have some smoked oysters for $2. Down the cereal aisle, it's looking pretty good. We still have instant oatmeal, regular oatmeal, pancake mix. Over here, we are running a little low on some of the raisins and dried fruit, but we do have canned fruit. We have fruit snacks, the snack pack puddings, Pop-Tarts, granola bars. They have the $1 granola bars, peanut butter and chocolate chip granola bars. I think my kids would like a couple of these. We still have fruit snacks and the knockoff Pop-Tarts for $1 granola bars, plenty of coffee and tea, and instant coffee and coffee creamer. And then it looks like we have more than enough cereal and they're actually having a sale, three for $6. This expires on the 22nd, this sale. So if you guys are interested in getting some cereal, please go on the Family Dollar app and check the current ad. I don't know how long it's gonna take for me to edit this video, but I'm trying to pace myself with some of my videos. So hopefully I share this sooner than later. I found a bunch of clearance over here. We have mostly like detergent and things over here. I wanted to also show you guys trash bags because I know that's something that's been a really big seller and this store is loaded with plenty of trash bags. They even have some dollar trash bags. Now let's head on down the, what aisle? The Clorox aisle, the wipes aisle, the medication aisle, and see what we may have. There's a whole lot of clearance going on over here, you guys a whole, whole lot of clearance. And I just wanted to see if we have any essentials here that we need. We do have some Clorox Fragancia, Pine Sol, and Fabuloso. That's something to keep in mind. If you're having a hard time finding it, then, you know, consider looking in the clearance sections. Maybe you'll get lucky with that hard to find item. Ammonia more Fabuloso, more bleach. We have plenty of bleach, you guys. Plenty of bleach here in Family Dollar. We have plenty of floor cleaner. This area though is totally wiped out still. The cleaning and sanitizing wipes are totally gone as well as the fabric spray that was here about 10 days ago when I came out. The surface cleaner is limited to four. So we do have some Clorox. This is my first time seeing Clorox and we have some Lysol. Yay. Here's a little update on the hand soap too, you guys. We do have Dial antibacterial back in stock as well as soft soap back in stock. And the limits are four per customer. Okay, let's look really quick. Over here, yes, a limit of four 
$4.15 for some flushable wipes. One dollar. Yes, you guys, they have a lot of that. And last but not least, let's see how we're doing in the medication area. Again, Tylenol is pretty much wiped out everywhere, but we do have some of the rapid release. Actually, they have more Tylenol here than many of my other stores. I think all their Excedrin is gone, but they do have some Tylenol. So if you guys are looking for Tylenol, come to Family Dollar. And then I believe all the immunity support stuff is gone. NyQuil. They still have cough drops. Tylenol Sinus, ages two to 11. They do have some children's Tylenol and some children's cough and cold. They actually have a nice variety of kids and babies medication here. That's the first time that I've seen that much in a store in weeks. They have the Fragonzia here. That's by Clorox. Some nice little bundles. And the pet food, the pet food is not a problem at all. They have plenty of cat and dog food here in Family Dollar. Friskies is even on sale. I just found a Tylenol cold and flu and even one on clearance. Yeah, you guys, there is a lot to be had here at Family Dollar. If you guys are losing hope because you can't find some of these items in the bigger stores like Walmart and Target, then come to a smaller store, go to a smaller town, and maybe you'll have some luck with things like Tylenol, things like bleach, and stuff that maybe you're having a hard time finding. But anyways, you guys, that's it for me. I came in here to get my eggs and my ramen, and I am heading home. Thank you guys so, so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.